Jimmy McMillan of the Renters Too Damn High Party. Good morning, the 24th of August. This is a Sunday morning, around 8.55. I want to take a time, a minute, and clear up a uh, misunderstanding of uh, that it has been taking place, and I want to try to get it right. Uh, I do want to add that um, I come out of Vietnam in 1969. Uh, some of you may see 1968 because that's what the military papers had uh, printed, but I was held over in Vietnam for an additional time because of a misunderstanding, a racial misunderstanding between myself and some of the sons of the Ku Klux Klan in Vietnam. But uh, I had come home and I read this article in the newspaper, and this article read, we are going to run all poor people out of New York. Now, what newspaper this was in was the, the Post, uh, Daily News. It wasn't in the time. It was, it was one of those newspapers. I just can't recall which one. I read it. At the time, I was a young kid, come out of the war. I didn't understand what it meant, didn't really care what it meant. But as years later, I kept remembering that phrase, we are going to run all poor people out of New York. And if I look at things today, and this is exactly what they are doing whoever they say, whoever we is to them, I'll say they are doing exactly what they promised. But a twist happened is because this was targeted, uh, because it was a very racial time in American history, but as the years passed along, it kind of shifted away from racism to poor people, and they are coming all creeds and colors. 178 different ethnic groups in the state of New York uh, this is what this is targeting. Um, mainly it was targeting those who had no wealth passed on to them from their parents and grandparents. And I think you know the differences they had in America, you know who that group were. But it has shifted because it is no longer that group uh, who uh, not have anything passed to them from their ancestors. It is those, it is everyone, all the children. Uh, it was, it's like a mixed bowl of soup and everyone is suffering from this problem that we have now. Kids can't afford to live here no matter what color, race, creed, and all, just say 178 different ethnic groups of children can't afford to live here. It's why I'm urging you to stand up independently and vote independent. Uh, the Democrat Republican Party has no future for you in this country. Um, I would explain that if you listen to my YouTube videos, uh, listen to them carefully. The message is there. Just listen to one at a time. And I'm speaking of what I'm saying now in each, in one of those videos, I can't recall, to help you understand what is that, what has happened economically in America and why there is no room or there is no home for you in this country. You are being pushed out, but you are a cause of it because of your lack of involvement and how to get involved. And when you do, you go behind the wrong groups. And there is a way to get this right, but you also have to go behind the wrong groups to make it right. Anyway, uh, enough for the Sunday morning. Go to church, all of you, and uh, those who go to church, I don't, but uh, uh, I, I, I chose to say to you is that we have to participate in the election process to change this country around. And there is no if, as, and but. Enjoy your Sunday. Enjoy the rest of the week. If you don't hear from me during the week, but I'm pretty sure you will. And once again, this is Jimmy McMillan, the founder of the Rent is Too Damn High Party.